Science. Aileen Lee fills a syringe with a saline solution that contains tiny rods made of silica. Those rods form the basis of a new method to fight everything from cancer to Ebola in the human body. Professor David Mooney says the human immune system is the most efficient weapon to fight disease. These rods will help to activate it in order to respond to threats. One could inject these through a needle because they're so small and then after they're in the body they would be present in a fluid, a saline solution or salt solution and then as that salt solution dissipated into the surrounding tissue these particles would then collapse on each other and form this three-dimensional structure. That three-dimensional structure is basically a makeshift laboratory which takes shape inside the body. It plays the role of a trap releasing drug molecules which were implanted into nanopores fitted onto the rods to attract immune cells to the structure. We utilize these nanopores to release a factor that brings about millions and millions of immune cells to this local 3D structure. And there, the cells reside in the pores that are formed between the microparticles, and they're, they're able to be then, you know, subsequently programmed to do their job. At this point, the tiny lab turns into a factory and puts the dendritic cells into action. Also known as accessory cells, they are the body's own surveillance tool used to identify threats. The cells are reprogrammed and fitted with proteins to trigger an immune response in the body. And that's when the body starts combating disease and infection. Scientists are hopeful this will become a powerful tool in years to come.